are in the core business. Are you ready? <laughs> Sander Berlin, please. Uh, well, good afternoon, everyone. Before I start telling about a career in the core business, it's very important that I first tell something about myself. Um, I am a lecturer from the marketing department since one and a half year. I teach there several courses in the bachelor and the master, I do some supervision. And besides that, I also received an uh, award as excellent teacher. But don't worry, I'm not here to talk about myself. I'm here to talk about our university and its future. Well, if I say our university, I actually mean your university, because this is a true story. Exactly one week ago, I went to my management team and I told them I'm going to quit as a teacher. And now the question arises, why? Why do I quit as a teacher? Because I love my job, I love my colleagues, I'm challenged every day, but the simple answer to this question is that I don't have a future at this university. And that's what I want to talk about, because together with me, there are a lot of teachers that don't actually have a future here. And if I look at my own situation, that's the same for a lot of teachers, there are a couple problems. First problem is that we have temporary contracts. As you might know, every teacher gets a contract for two to four years, and after that, they have to leave. And there is a new law in the Netherlands that says, well, we try to force employers to get tenure for temporary contracts, after temporary contracts. But this university actually uses a loophole, sends uh, teachers at home, let them wait on the couch for half a year, and then let them come back, which I think is a bit strange. And this makes it very difficult to keep our teachers, because why would we stay if we only have a short amount of time, if we can't work in our careers? And it's not only a waste for us teachers self, but also for the entire university, because we invest in teachers, we spend a lot of money, a lot of time, we pay for an expensive UTQ or a university teaching qualification, and after two to four years, it's all down the drain. But let's assume that that isn't an issue, that we still have something like the job profile. Because like any other university, this university has really explicit job profiles. And if I look at my own job profile, I actually am only allowed to read out slides that other people have made to bachelor students. Luckily, because of uh, high workloads, I can often do things where I do have to think about, and that makes, in my case, my job interesting, but not everybody is in that position. So in sum, uh, like our uh, Emil Art say, said, it's very important, like Copenhagen uh, used to say, that we uh, focus on education. But the way we do it now, it's impossible to focus on good quality education. And I'm not only here to complain, but I try to give you a solution to these problems. And in my opinion, the biggest solution would be to offer some kind of career uh, perspective. And don't worry, I'm not talking about that every teacher should get tenure. There must be a flexible shell for uh, a lot of teachers for student fluctuation. But now there isn't a career opportunity at all. And especially for teachers like me, I don't have a PhD, I'm not pursuing a PhD, but I do believe that it's important for each teacher to have a PhD. But our current PhD programs are arranged in such a way that we train them to become a good scientist and not a good educator. But even if we would have a special PhD program, then we still have a problem, because if I would have a PhD and I want to become an associate professor, I have, to, uh, I have the requirements to get four A publications. So in other words, I'm a teacher, my core business is teaching, but I'm getting evaluated on my uh, research skills. And we all know the saying, if you uh, judge a fish by its abilities to climb a tree, it will never feel appreciated. <coughs> but let's assume that we could make other objectives and that we set other goals for these teachers. Are we there yet? Unfortunately, we are not. Because there's something going on at this university, unfortunately. This problem, so to say, is a problem that's go been going on for many, many years. And there used to be an experiment where teachers could become adjunct associate professors instead of associate professors. And there is a very painful point, because this shows that teachers are not valued with adjunct associate title as much as our researchers. And 
believe me, I do think that research and science is a core value of our university. It's extremely important. But we have another core value, and that's education. So for me, it's already too late. I will be leaving on the 1st of April, but I hope, and I really do, that by 2025, uh, all the teachers that are in a position like me have an honest, a fair, and real chance to pursue uh, some, uh, something in the core business, our core values, and to pursue a real career in the core business. Thank you. Thank you.